1. Take good care of yourself. Physical appearance plays a huge role in whether or not someone will be attracted to someone else. 1. How well you care for your physical health and appearance is something that people can see right away, so it is worth putting some extra time and energy into while you are trying to attract someone. People will notice if you don't care for yourself and this may make someone lose interest. To ensure that you look your best, exercise, eat right, practice proper hygiene and wear clean, flattering clothing. Don't be afraid to capture attention. To make a name for yourself, do something that they will remember and show them that there is so much more to you than just a pretty smile. Make sure that your personality shines through and he, she knows about your likes and dislikes. Being passionate about something is very attractive and others will take notice. Be proud of your accomplishments and confident in your abilities. Confidence is something that people admire, so don't be shy about what you have accomplished. 2. 3. Be kind. Treat others the way you want to be treated. It may sound cheesy, but it's true. If you want others to treat you with care and respect, you should start treating others this way, too. People are more likely to fall in love with other people who have great personalities, who are polite, and who are kind to others. 3. 4. Show your flaws. Let him or her see how far you've come. For example, if you are fit and active now, but you used to be a couch potato, tell the person about your transformation. Revealing some of your past shortcomings to someone will allow him or her to see the real you and appreciate you even more. 4. 1. Don't act like you're not bothered. So many people do this. Pretending that you don't care or aren't bothered about the relationship does not help and makes the other person feel a burden and this will not work. To be emotionally available, relationships are hard. Before trying to get someone to fall in love with you, be sure that you are ready for one. If you are too hung up on a past relationship, or more interested in dating someone else, or just not ready for commitment, don't try to get someone to fall in love with you. 5. 3. Ask yourself if this is the one. Consider how you feel about this person. Do you love him or her? You'll want to be sure that you feel romantic love for the person and not just the love felt between close friends. It can often be difficult to tell the difference. If you don't love the person yet, then consider slowing things down. If it is meant to be then you will both develop feelings together. For thinking about your motives. Think about why you want to be in a relationship. If you only want a person to love you in order to feel better about losing another relationship or to make someone jealous, then getting that person to fall in love with you is a bad idea. This is inconsiderate towards the very real feelings they may end up developing. If you want someone to fall in love with you because you want to be with someone for a long time and have a mutually supportive relationship, then go ahead. 6. 5. Consider your goals. Determine your long-term goals for the relationship. If you can't see it lasting, there isn't much sense in trying to make someone fall in love with you. This is emotionally cruel to both yourself and the other person. There is nothing wrong with casual dating, if you want to date someone but don't see it lasting, just enjoy it for what it is and don't try to make it more serious. You don't need to be in love to keep dating. 6. Believe that there are other people. Sometimes we have feelings for someone that are not returned. This is okay. You shouldn't feel like it's the end of the world or that there's no one else for you. There are an awful lot of people on this planet, after all. If someone doesn't return your feelings you should understand that it wasn't meant to be and that you wouldn't have been all that happy together. You'll find someone else before you know it and wonder why you ever felt upset in the first place. Don't try to be someone you are not to get someone to fall in love with you. Make sure that the person you decide to be with is compatible with you as you are. 7. 1. Get to know the person better. The first step in getting someone to love you is to get to know the person better and allowing the person to get to know you. Getting to know someone takes time and energy because you will have to ask the right questions and listen well. Ask about what your love interest wanted to be as a child and what he or she wants to do now. This will tell you about the person's hopes and dreams, as well as other things that he or she wants to get out of life. Ask about likes, dislikes, interests, hobbies, and goals. To share the person's passions. Show an interest in the things that your love interest loves and learn to appreciate the things that make him or her happy. Don't fake your interest because people can often tell when you are not really interested in something. Try to experience the person's interests through his or her eyes and share in their